What's going on, Hit Squad? It's your main man, Hitman, and I am back. Once again, with the daily spawn updates for Red Dead Redemption 2 Online. This is for the family heirlooms, all the Zuri, the coins, the heads, the flowers, the antique alcohol bottles, all tarot cards, the bird eggs, and the fossils. Today is Wednesday, July 7th, and as I say each and every video, Smash that thumbs up button if you find this video any bit informative or helpful in any type of way. And if you're watching, just browsing, just checking out the channel, just checking out the cycles, just checking out me in general. Make sure you guys subscribe. That's the most important part. <laughs> subscribe and hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out because I put out videos each and every day. If you guys want to know Madame Nazara's location any bit early in the earlier than this video make sure you follow me on instagram and twitter at hitman miyagi yt how to spell that will be in the bottom left hand corner of your screen it'll be below the video and the hashtag and they'll be it will be down in the description box below um first things first before i get to the first things first <laughs> if you did uh, follow me on Instagram and or Twitter. Uh, I posted the video for the trailer for next week when the update comes. So if you didn't go either on Rockstar or go on my page where you can see the trailer for the video. It doesn't give too much information, but I mean, it got, I guess it shows a little visual for what we have going on. Um that's pretty much kind of all i had to say about that remember to do your uh cycles and all that stuff make sure you guys have money for the upcoming situations so you can i mean even if you don't turn them in which i if i do do any more cycles i won't be turning them in until after everything so i can you know get my outlaw pass out the way and all kinds of stuff like that and get a little bit of extra cash spending money i should be okay with money and gold and stuff like that but let's get to what you guys are here for <laughs> first things first madam nazara's location which she's been in the same spot for like four days now she's up here in big valley if you guys have been to her any any at any point within these last couple of days she's still there and she should still be on your map if not, this is where she is, and she will be there possibly until 2 a.m. I feel like they should only change like Madame Nazar's location like once a week. That would be kind of okay with me. I mean, like, you know, like why change her so much? Why every day? <laughs> but she may be here until 2 a.m. That's Eastern Standard Time, New York Time Zone. East Coast Time Zone, for those of you who don't know. Or not of America. I don't know where she's going after this. Or if she's even moving. But that's where she is for today. Until 2 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. How I get to her is I try to move my camp here. Or you can simply fast travel to Strawberry and run up. If you feel like running. If you got a good horse and you like to ride on your horse. And actually play the game. Ride your horse up from Strawberry. And there you go. <laughs> The next thing is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle, which today is right outside of Armadillo, right between the R and I of Springs. Right here at this location, there's a tent. On the ground in front of that tent, you guys should see a glowing bottle if you use your eagle eye. And that glowing bottle is the Caribbean Rum Antique Alcohol Bottle for today. Right here at this location, make sure you guys pay attention to these faint lines in the map and all kinds of placements i try to push it put it like right at the bottom of the lettering and go across inside this little circle right here or whatever you want to call it and i put the waypoint it's right there at that location anyway let's get over here to where we normally do business which is the lemoyne side of the map i'm gonna zoom in for you guys so you guys can get a good idea of where everything is or a better the best idea about that anyway the cycles for today wednesday july 7th are family heirloom cycle one 
All Luxury Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 1, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antique Alcohol Bottle Cycle 2, All Terror Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossil Cycle 6. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel, which is Hitman Miyagi YT. Uh, let's get to these things that we will find across the Lemoyne area of the map. These are my little extras to get you guys on your way. Uh, we're going to start with the items that are more high and work our way down let's go all the way up to right about here up here above this triangle you see that triangle right there right above that triangle about right here you guys will get an antique alcohol bottle this antique alcohol bottle is underneath a wagon kinda it's like at the back of the wagon but like on the ground and this antique alcohol bottle is a grand corazon and it will be here until tomorrow, 8 p.m. Let's go down a little bit where our first marker is. Right here at this location, you guys will get a fossil, a random fossil. Come right here with your metal detector. And that's what you will dig up, a random fossil. Right here along the shoreline, there's a boat. Go inside that boat on the bottom floor of it. Go inside the boat and buy the wash table or wash area, the sink area. There's an ivory comb, which is a family heirloom, sitting right there next to that sink. Let's go down a little bit. There's a bunch of cards, like there's a card here. There's a card here. There's a card over here, I think inside this shack right here. There's a card right here over in the little storage area. These are all extras from what I um, have marked already, just so you guys can go get it if you're watching a video. Right here at this location inside the house is a chimney. Go to the chimney and you, you will get a prompt to search it and you will pull out a Durant Pearl bracelet, which is a lost jewelry. If you guys go outside the house, there's a big tree around in this area. Go to that big tree with your metal detector and you guys will dig up another lost jury. It's a random lost jury. I cannot tell you what it is, but make sure you have your metal detector and shovel and that's what you will get. Let's go down to our next marker, which is if you guys pay attention to these lines, there's like a bush right here at this location of this next marker and go like kind of underneath the bush with your metal detector and you guys will get a random fossil you will get a prompt to dig up a random fossil i cannot tell you what fossil it is because it is randomized we have two more markers up here this first marker inside this convenience store if you've been watching you should know what it is this is a old time gin antique alcohol bottle you don't necessarily know which one it is but it's an antique alcohol bottle this antique alcohol bottle is an old time gin bottle as i said it's on the counter kind of like, I can't really explain, but it's like right here <laughs> inside the building. Go through the door. The door is here. And the antique alcohol bottle is right here on top of the counter. You may have, have to jump over like some shelves or whatever to, to get to it. Right here at our next marker, you guys will get a random coin. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get at this location. But come over here with your metal detector. And that's what you will dig up. A random coin. Let's go down. Well, let's go all the way over to the right a little bit. Right here at this location. At the back porch of this house, you guys, on the table, you guys will get a horse hairbrush. This horse hairbrush is on the table, on the back porch or deck, right here at this location. Let's go into the cemetery, which I have one item, which is an antique alcohol bottle. Another antique alcohol bottle. This antique alcohol bottle is a absinthe bottle. A-B-S-I-N-T-H-E. It's in a mausoleum right here at this location. Go through the entrance, which is right here, and which there's a gate. Go through the gate and go to the little shelf right there at that location. I hate when I do that. 
please ignore all that. <laughs> Anywho, right there at that location, I tried to take that out. Uh, Anywho, right here at our next marker, you guys will get a tarot card. This tarot card is sitting on a white table with a chessboard on it. And on that chessboard, you guys will get a Eight of Swords tarot card right here at this location. Go across the way, which I usually go through this little opening right here and jump over the wall. And there's another table, same way, white table, chessboard on it. And on that chessboard, you guys will get a ivory hairpin. It's a two, two little situation, same way. I like it. Let's go down to our next marker, which is a bird egg. This bird egg is a spoonbill egg. This spoonbill egg is in a tree. Shoot it down with a warmer rifle or a bow using a small game arrow right here at this location. Down to our next marker, which is the cardinal flower that spawns over here each and every day. Right here at this location, this um, it spawns over here each and every day and it helps me personally indicate exactly what cycle the flowers are on, which today is cycle two. If you guys go inside this building, there's another antique alcohol bottle, which is, if I'm not mistaken, is a cognac bottle. Right here inside this structure, go inside, there's an overturned barrel, and right at the edge of the overturned barrel, you should see the cognac bottle. Let's go over. Actually, let's go up to Rhodes. There's a couple things inside of Rhodes I want to tell you guys about along with our next marker right here inside the E, right here at this location. Put a waypoint or a marker, and you guys will get a random coin. This random coin is at the base of a dead tree that's sticking out of the ground. Go to that tree, because it's one sticking out of the ground, there's two laying on the ground. Go to the one that's sticking out of the ground with your metal detector, and you will hit on a random coin. I cannot tell you guys what coin you will get, but that's what it is at this location. I have about five other things to tell you guys about, which the first two, one is inside this saloon right here. Right here at this location, there's a room, and inside one of these rooms, there's a room here, and there's a room down here. The room that you're looking for is the one that's on this side. Right here at this location, you guys will get a New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush. It's on a chair in the room on the ground floor. So you will go straight through this door that's right here. And then right directly to your right, there's another door that leads you into a bedroom. In that bedroom on the chair, you guys will see the New Guinea Rosewood hairbrush, which is a family heirloom. Let's go over a little bit to this location on the second floor. On the table, there's a, like there's like a little spiral staircase. Go up the little spiral staircase onto onto the second floor, and on the table you should see like a rocking chair and a table, and stuff like that. There's a King of Cups tarot card on that table. Let's go over one more, where this is a dig spot, right here at this location next to a barrel. On this side of the barn. You guys will get a family heirloom. This family heirloom is a ebony hairpin. This ebony hairpin, you do not need your metal detector for this one. You just need your shovel. So come over here ready. If you have too many, you won't be able to dig it up anyway. So right here at this next location, on a bench, I think, on a bench on this front porch of this house. You guys will get a Two of Wands tarot card if you do come over here. Go over here across the way from the fence. Right here at this location, you guys will get another tarot card, which is a Ten of Cups. This Ten of Cups is on the table beside a bucket of water. That's pretty much it for everything that I have for you guys. All the extras and stuff. I'm going to zoom in a little bit so you guys can see everything. Trying to get everything into frame. So you can see everything we talked about. Uh, the cycles for today. Wednesday. July 7th. Once again are. Family heirloom cycle 1. All auxiliary cycle 2. Coin cycle 1. Arrowhead cycle 6. 
Wildflower Cycle 2, Antic Alcohol Bottle Cycle 2, All Terror Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossil Cycle 6. Once again, Family Heirloom Cycle 1, All Azure Cycle 2, Coin Cycle 1, Arrowhead Cycle 6, Wildflower Cycle 2, Antic Alcohol Bottle Cycle 2, All Terror Card Cycle 1, Bird Egg Cycle 2, and Fossils Cycle 6. Remember to check the description box below because everything will be down there. The cycles, a link to a video for the current cycle of fossils, and how to spell the Twitter and Instagram for the channel. Remember, well, not remember, but thank you guys for watching. <laughs> um, if you thank you guys for watching, looking, listening, liking, sharing, commenting, subscribing. I do appreciate each and every bit of it, and I try to say it as much as possible. And if you haven't, if you don't. Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you guys can get each and every video that I put out each and every day. And share the video. Maybe, you know, somebody else play the game and can help out. I think the game was free this month or something like that. So we might get like new uh, newcomers to the, to the game and stuff like that. Maybe people got PlayStation and PlayStation Plus and want to play the Red Dead Redemption. Who knows? <laughs> They need help with the game. Anywho, it's your baby man Hitman once again. And I'm out.